morning we are just about to check out of our hotel here in Kyoto and um, we might leave our bags here while we go but we're going to head over to uh, Glanta um, which is a place where you can make custom rings so we booked an appointment for 10 30 to go do that we're also going to go check out the Starbucks which is nearby and if we get time we're going to try and go to Kiyomizudera as well We'll see how we go. We were calculating how long it takes to get to Osaka. It actually is only like 15 minutes by Shinkansen, so it doesn't take very long. It's just a matter of how frequently the JR uh, Shinkansen are running. So we will need to go to Kyoto Station at some time and figure out what train we're going to get. But that's fine. We've got plenty of time. So we're going to head out now, leave our bags downstairs hopefully, and go to Glanta and make our rings. Oh my, the banana room. We're done. Got our rings. I don't think you're going to be able to see my engraving on this camera. You can see it on my iPhone. Oh, you can't. You kind of can. It says and always. And show me yours. Ah. That's Dylan's ring. And his says forever. Mine says and always. Isn't that a bit cute? It is. The best part was we got to make each other's. Yeah, we made each other's rings, so it's, it's special. It's from the heart. Alright, now it's time for some Starbucks.
<laughs> so I think you have to try and lift both. Some people have been able to do the first one, but the second one I haven't seen anybody do it yet. <laughs> oh, that's easy. Okay. Now this one. <laughs> ready. <laughs> He's ready. Okay, go on. Come on, you got this. Yeah. <laughs> This is the famous view from Kiyomizudera. That was where we just were. And uh, you look out, you can see in the background there, that's Kyoto Tower. It's beautiful. Look at this. I don't know if it's gonna pick up on them. Where are they? I think they're blending in. I need to move. There we go. Those spiders. They're just hanging above on the trees. Yuck. And then you, yep. And then I think you turn it. <laughs> Oh, what did you get? Oh. <laughs> oh. It's, an, it's an archie though. It's an archie. Do you, do you want me to do one? So then you can have a second shot? I didn't get a shoe. <laughs> Got my Mitrashi dango. I've been trying to try this. In Every time I go past it, I've just never been in the mood for it. We finally found it, so we're going to give it a go. Okay. It's, it's quite hot on the bottom, so it looks scared. It's really very different to what I thought it would be. There's not. Update. I just did a quick Google of what Mitrash heat dangra is. It's actually supposed to be a savory, more savory sauce. So the so it's it's a soy sauce coating. So that's why I was like, it doesn't taste sweet. Because it's not meant to. And that was my bad. I didn't pick that up. But I have heard really good things about it before, so I still want to try it. Now we can see how done it. The bags have been acquired. <laughs> Look at the thing on your forehead. 
Wow. You like the angle of the <laughs> No, that's just my actual forehead. Goodbye, Skellington. Skellington. Skelling. Why can't I say skeleton? Goodbye, skeleton. All right. Skellington. <laughs> and then I said skeleton. Skeletal. Uh, yes, we're heading to Shijo Station where we can then get a train to Kyoto Station and then sort out our Shinkansen. I don't know what time I'm going to get there. We're also not really in a rush, but this took a lot longer than we thought it was going to. Like it's all, it's 2.30 now, which is, I thought we'd be done by like midday. So yeah, let's go. Did we survive, Dylan? Uh, fun time. We made it. Catching the Thunderbird Express. Thunderbird train, because apparently that'll take us to Osaka Station instead of Shin Osaka, which is further away from our accommodation. So it takes like double the time, which is like half an hour, which is fine. It's also covered by JR, so it's still not an issue. Just a little bit different in terms of finding it. It's on the regular JR line instead of a Shinkansen. So it's currently that's not the time. 3.22. Oh my gosh. Go on Instagram. 3.22 at the moment. We've got about 15 minutes till our train. Thank you. I might go get a, a Coke or something. I don't know. I'm feeling a bit thirsty. So I'll update you when we're on the train. Mr. Poke. Osaka, they're already coming for our money. Nintendo, Pokemon Center, One Piece. Let's go. Wait. Yeah, this is. Whoa. <laughs> cool. Anyway, we're catching the Osaka loop to get to Bentensho, which is where we are staying. Anyway, we're here at Benten Station. Yeah, that's all I know. I've never watched Ben 10. Anyway, we're at Ben Tentro Station. We're about a three minute walk from our accommodation. And it's after three o'clock. It's four o'clock actually. 4.20 to be, no. Yeah, almost 4.20, blaze it. Uh, so we can check in straight away, which is like never happened to us. We did go to the Osaka Aquarium last time we were in Osaka. And it was, yeah, it was a good time. Probably won't do it again. Oh man, they got some Yakult in here. What is that? Ice cream? 17 ice. <laughs> Why are you going to buy an ice cream right now? What other snacks they got in? What are snackies in here? Yeah, they're not going to lie there. Oh, mochi truffle. 
chocolate brownie. Yeah, no, nothing really appealing to me. I'm not gonna lie. Would have. All right. Anyway, let's go. The number of breaks is limited. Yo, we're here at the hotel. You can't enter Motel. the restaurant in your pajamas. Holiday Inn. Got our bags. Safely have arrived in Osaka, and we're just heading over to our room. This way. Uh, I can't do this. Hold on. <laughs> Alright, time for a broom tour. This is the entryway. Got a little safe, little bench, which is cool, and a wardrobe. Little kitchen setup. Anything in the fridge? No. Some hotels give us water in the fridge, but. Like this oh sorry that's not the right light I don't know what this is turning on hopefully this is bathroom light yes I think it is this is the bathroom pretty spacious again we've definitely been in smaller bathrooms so we appreciate it and this is the main bed area again lots of space most Japanese hotels, especially like budget ones, the bed will kind of be to the wall, uh, so you can't really move around too much. But this one has quite a bit of ample room, and we also have a little desk with a mirror, which I will definitely need tomorrow when we're getting ready. So I appreciate it. Overall, I think it's a pretty good room. Location is pretty good as well. It's actually um, not too far away from Universal Studios, which is why I booked it. So. All right, checked in, had a little bit of a rest. It's currently, can't really see it, but it's 5.20. Basically, we're heading back on the train. We're gonna head to the Dotonbori area, which is like the most popular area to get food and also just like sightseeing in Osaka. It's really beautiful, especially at nighttime. And it is starting to, like the sun's starting to set. So hopefully by the time we get there, It'll be bustling. Just showed up. I'm told that the beef ones that we ordered and they're just too already. Oh, it's something else. So, pretty true. Oh, it's a deep fried squid. So, maybe they're deep. Maybe they are deep fried. Right. So, it's like more sauce. Yeah. It's not coming out very well. There we go. Just a bit better. Just the beef. Okay, it's time to get stuck into it. So. 
I'll do the worst one. Hold on. Let's try again. Still going. But is it oishi? Huh? Is it oishi? Very oishi. Something more oishi. Guys, it's Sucker. Where's his nose Sucker gone? Sucker from Wish. Guys, I don't know if you can see this, but the part, there's like a screw that holds my microphone in place and it kept coming loose and I thought I had fixed it and then we were in Dotsonbori and it fell out and I couldn't find it. So now I've like MacGyvered it with this rubber band and I'm going to try and do a better job of it now, but it's really annoying. It's only been like, what, not even a week being here? Boo. It's 9.32. My home just winding down after a, a long day of travel and lots of walking. Um, my watch is dead, but I'm pretty sure last time we checked steps for the day. This is not accurate. I think this is stop tracking after my watch died. Let me check the health app, I'll tell you. Health apps got me at 18,822. What about you? 19,457. Okay, well somewhere between 18 and 19,000 steps today. So it was a big day. Always is. We're in Osaka. It's great. We're excited. We... I really enjoyed going down to Dotenbori again and just eating all the good stuff that they had there. The Okonomiyaki and the Taiyaki... Not Taiyaki. Takiyaki. No. Takoyaki. Takoyaki. Oh gosh, so the okonomiyaki, the takoyaki, the skewers were good, the lemon sours were good. We got some ice cream as well, but I was a bit distracted with that because I lost my screw for my road mic. I'll have to show you later how I've like, I, I already had fixed up with like an elastic band, but now I've just gone ham with like head, um, with, I've gone ham with like hair ties and stuff and just been like trying to hold it together. So I'm hoping it's going to manage just because I don't think I can... I'm going to be able to find the replacement screw here in Japan anyway. So in terms of the rest of the night, I think I'm I'm probably just going to get ready for bed soon. Um, tomorrow we have our first day at Universal, but we have the 1.5 day ticket. So we don't actually get entry until 3 p.m. So the plan is for Universal is to really just make use of the the Halloween Horror Night side of things So once we get in there, we can start tackling the the mazes and not the mazes the houses There are only three houses so not too many to cover but they also have after 6 p.m After 6 p.m. They have a bunch of like, you know Halloween based activities and like, you know all the the monsters and everything come out and the scare zones and all that go live around 6 p.m. So there's that. If we can get any rides done, like, you know, especially ones that aren't going to be covered on our express passes, we'll definitely try. I don't think we'll be able to get into Super Nintendo World, unfortunately, because you do need a timed entry for that. But we could potentially get to Harry Potter, like, Wizarding World, because I don't think you need it for there anymore. So, yeah, we're going to just see what we can do uh, during the day. I feel like it's just we're gonna take it easy like maybe you go find something for breakfast and then just I don't know have a relaxed day knowing that we have to go to Universal at 3 that will be like till I don't know what time Universal closes in in Japan let me let me just check that as well Universal Studios Osaka 
Why doesn't it have business hours? Here we go, operation hours. Um, so tomorrow, they're open till 10. So from three to 10, that would give us seven hours worth of time in there if we stay the whole time. Looks like every day that we're there, they'll open, but they're, they're open eight to 10 p.m., um, 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. So, yep. This as well with, with the Halloween Horror Nights side of things, like, the more we get through tomorrow, the, the less we have to do the following day. And because there is a lot of stuff that happens during the day as like family friendly Halloween, uh, I do want to cover some of that as well, which we'll probably miss most of it yet tomorrow. We'll like, you know, aim for that on, on the Thursday. Is it Thursday? What's the day today? Sorry, Wednesday. Uh, Pokemon. They have like Pokemon shows and like the Pokemon um, like characters come out. You can meet them. They have like minions and stuff as well, which probably won't, won't appeal to, to Dylan and I. But Hello Kitty, uh, like all kinds of cool stuff happens during the day that's like the family friendly side of Halloween Horror Nights. It's also f all free, like you don't have to pay extra for that in your ticket like you do at the US parks. Um, it's all included, so that's really cool. So I'm excited to experience Halloween at uh, USJ because I've heard they do it quite well. I've heard good things about the houses as well. The three that they do have are all quite good. And they also have the um, Sadako's, uh, it's like a roller coaster, but they have a, a, a layout um, for Halloween of the, like the ring. Um, is it the ring? Yeah, it is the ring. Yeah, the one with the well. Yes. The Sorry, my English is failing. Not lay over, overlay is the word I'm looking for. So yeah, they have an overlay for the roller coaster, which is cool. Keen to do that keen to just get through whatever we can so we can make the most. I just didn't personally think we'd get everything done in one day, which is how long we spent there last time. Most vlogs and stuff I watched advised like two whole days, but I think this is a nice medium. So it means that on Wednesday we can focus on Super Nintendo World, which is like, you know, we've got express passes for that. We're pretty keen for that. Wizarding World, you know, all the express pass rides that we're doing and, you know, whatever is going on during the day for Halloween as well. So, yep, I'm going to stop rambling, get ready for bed, figure out what I'm wearing and stuff tomorrow, and uh, we'll see you in the morning for some more adventures in Osaka. Bye!